Well, it's one for the money. The Jack Parnell career is one that's chock full of firsts. Two for the show. As a staff announcer at his first radio station, Jack was the first to play one of rock and roll's all-time classics. Three to get ready now, go cat, go, but don't you step on my blue suede shoes. Then Jack took his own blue suede shoes over to Jackson, working as a jock and booth announcer at WDXI Radio and Television. It was there that he and his voice got the attention of one of our first-year inductees, Wink Martindale. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Wink Martindale. Still brimming with pride as one of the original career inductees into the Tennessee Radio Hall of Fame just three years ago. I was honored that evening. You may remember I had my longtime friend and fellow buddy and broadcaster Jack Parnell introduce me. And now I'm delighted to return the favor. Over the next 13 years, Jack led WHBQ to their highest ratings before or since. Oh, and by the way, it was WHBQ that was the first radio station to ever play Elvis Presley. Well, that's all right, Mama. That's all right for you. That's all right. Mama. And numbers? How would you like to have numbers like this? Well, Jack had them. For a couple of years, Jack took his talents across town to WMC. But a voice like Jack's is just too big for just one station. Jack Parnell has been the voiceover talent for all my shows for at least 35 years now. There are four simple reasons for that. One is, I love Jack's voice. Two, my entire crew love Jack's voice. Three, my wife Diane loves Jack's voice. His voice, I said. <laughs> and four, Heck, I don't know anyone anywhere who doesn't love Jack Parnell's voice. And I sincerely wish I could be there tonight with you, buddy, to personally congratulate you, my friend, on this well-deserved induction into the Tennessee Radio Hall of Fame. <laughs> Man, it would take an encyclopedia-sized manual to say enough about the great fishing here in Choctaw Hatchie Bay. It's an Jack's radio and voicing career has truly been quite an inspiration. I was watching WBBJ TV and I heard this booth announcer with a with a warm velvet tone voice doing like station breaks and promos. Before it's baked, or are you going to get a tan this time? Well, if a tan is in your plans this million dollar weekend, then there's only one way to do it with Johnson's, baby. So put that tan back in your plans. Go on out and soak up some rays right now. Turn it all on. With and Johnson's. I said, wow. Right, it was the voice of a young Jack Parnell. Chances are he sounded as good then as he does today. A talent such as his is a gift from God. It's a talent one is born with. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege and pleasure to present for induction into the Tennessee Radio Hall of Fame, my friend, a real pro. Here's Mr. Jack Parnell. Okay, get ready as we welcome our newest member to the Tennessee Radio Hall of Fame. Here comes Jack Parnell. Jack Parnell with some wonderful music that'll make you smile just listen a while you love his style here's jack parnell 